Oh, yeah. U.S. Army Reserve soldiers with the 402nd Engineer Company, Sapper Unit, trained at Fort McCoy on some of their explosive options. First, they shaped their charges, then got to work. They trained on the selectable lightweight attack munition, commonly referred to as SLAM. They also trained on the blasting demolition kit, also known as the BDK. Uh, so today, the whole course this entire past week has been over the BDK and the SLAM. So today we just went out and actually took that to the to the range and tested it all out to see its capabilities and basically what how we would actually be able to use these kits under our mission depending upon what unit you're in. Fire in the hole. For some soldiers who have never worked with explosives before, their first time can be a nerve-wracking experience. Five, four, three, two, one. I think one of the not the most important, but one of the coolest aspects on on these, whether it's the BDK or the SLAM, is the safety with that is already into the system. It's already integrated into the systems, you know, with battery time down, shut off, with, I mean, there's a lot of different things to where it takes out the, the guessing game. Fire the hole! Fire the hole! Fire the hole! Let's get around that door. These soldiers trained on shape charges as well as linear charges so they can experience firsthand what these explosives are capable of against armor as well as tracked vehicles. Reporting from Fort McCoy, Wisconsin, I'm Sergeant Bill Washburn. Right, ready? Yeah. Fire in the hole! Fire in the hole! Fire in the hole! Push. Twist. <laughs>